Queen Margrethe announced over the weekend that she is stepping down as Denmark's reigning monarch. This news came as a surprise to many. Members of the Danish royal family have not abdicated since 1146, and many expected Margrethe to retain the crown for life. As Queen Elizabeth II did. However, it was a shock to many to hear when, in her annual New Year's address to the nation, Margrethe announced, on January 14, 2024, 52 years after I succeeded my father, I will step down as Queen of Denmark. I will pass the throne to my son, Crown Prince Frederick. She will be succeeded by her eldest son, Frederick, 55, and his 51-year-old Australian wife Mary. The Crown Princess in particular has had her share of coverage, although much has been written about her and Frederick's love story since their wedding in 2004, a whole new generation has begun to discover the future Queen of Denmark's origins. She grew up in Australia. Mary Donaldson was born in Hobart, Australia. The future Queen spent almost all of her childhood in Tasmania, except for one short year when her family moved to Houston, Texas, after her father took a job at the Johnson Space Test Center. She attended college at the University of Tasmania, graduating with a Bachelor of Commerce and Law. Like Kate Middleton, she is not of aristocratic descent. Mary is not of aristocratic descent, like another future queen, the Princess of Wales. Mary's parents worked in academia. Her mother, Henrietta, was the deputy dean of the University of Tasmania, and her father, a well-known scientist, worked as a professor of mathematics and still does research. She met Prince Frederick at a bar. Mary and Frederick met at Sydney Slip in Bar during the 2000 Olympics. He was with the current King of Spain, Felipe VI, then Prince of Asturias, who knew Mary's roommate and invited her to a party. Frederick and Mary, an advertising manager, quickly found a common language, liked each other. A long-distance relationship soon began point two weddings in May 2004. At her royal wedding at Copenhagen Cathedral in May 2004, Mary wore an ivory silk wedding dress with long sleeves and an Irish lace veil. Later, a reception for 400 people was held at Friedensborg Palace on Zealand Island. Mary and Frederick have four children. The crown princess and prince's four children are Christian, Isabella and royal twins Vincent and Josephine. Their son Christian will succeed his father and one day become king of Denmark. She is a fighter for women's rights. In Mary's official biography of Mary, the royal family emphasizes Mary's work to improve the lives of women in Denmark. Mary's foundation, which is dedicated to fighting bullying, domestic violence and loneliness. She is also a patron of the Maternity Foundation, which focuses on women's reproductive and sexual health.